What are we doing at the school? Why are they raising a green gold flag? And what is in viral schools? In New Zealand, we have seen stunning natural beauty, but also destruction and threats to the environment. One way New Zealand is engaging children in nature conservation is through a school program called Enviro Schools. Schools all over the country can get involved in the action-based program where young people plan and implement sustainability projects and become change makers. Some 1500 schools currently participate, involving some 350,000 students. At Kerry Kerry's Riverview School, students explain how they put the program into practice. Another program where we have got a white puppet string again and do some tests in the water about the animals that live there, water pollution and innovate invasive species that shouldn't be living there. By the acorn, acorn tree over there where um, Mrs. Balron actually made a bug hotel with her class for um, to keep the bugs safe from all the predators and it's still there and we've been checking up on it and the bugs look happy. The eight-year-olds tell us about their garden to table program. In the school's organic garden, they grow fruit and vegetables and prepare healthy dishes from the harvest. They also learn that the seasons determine which food they can grow and eat. They experience that growing their own food saves money and reduces emissions and packaging. The 11 year olds show us that they participated in Project Island Song, which rewilds nearby islands. Large areas were once deforested, which reduced the habitat of indigenous birds. Introduced predators like rats and possums further decimated the birds' numbers. The children planted trees and checked traps for introduced predators. They also witnessed the success of Project Island Song when they saw birds that have become very rare on the mainland, like the saddleback and the red-crowned parakeet. The school also has eco-warriors. Sporting blue vests, they lead the school's initiatives to reduce and recycle plastic waste. They keep the grounds clean and even check if discarded paper is flat. We do a bench check every week. And, um, we go across every classroom and we um, check in the pavement so bins and bins are all scratched, if the paper's all scratched up in the paper bin. That's not passed because the paper's going to be flattened out to be recycled. Enviro Schools is supported by a national foundation, Toymata, whose facilitators advise and support schools to implement the program. It is funded through New Zealand's regional councils. In Northland, the region where we are today, the regional council encourages schools to become an Enviro School by pointing out the program's benefits for the environment, the students, the economy and the community. In the assembly hall, the regional councillor praises the students for their efforts. We rely on kaitiaki to do the mahi in, in, the, in the north. Uh, and you, as the pupils and as the adults of the future are going to be the katiaki for, for Northland, for looking after this kaupapa of looking after the environment and sustainability of the region moving through. So I really congratulate you. 
He also emphasizes how the children take their learnings home. That what the children are learning is actually reflecting and being reflected back by their adult support, where it's happening. And that's how we are going to get a, a front and center across the whole of not just being taught at schools, but taking it up into the family and the family situation and the home environment. And that's why we will, we will be able to spread that co up really well. The school is recognized for achieving the green gold status after many years of implementing the Enviro Schools program. Thanks to the Enviro Schools program, students in almost 1500 schools in New Zealand are learning valuable life lessons about the environment and their role in safeguarding it. Could the program be New Zealand's next export product? We hope so! Bingo. Did you like this video? And want to see more? Subscribe to our YouTube channel, like us on social media, become our patron on Patreon or subscribe to our email newsletter on our website.